Imagine a tech giant valued at an incredible 12.5 billion dollars and making over a billion dollars annually operating not from silicon valley but from the heart of small quiet indian villages it sounds impossible like growing a giant redwood in a tiny garden pot right yet this is the astonishing reality of zoho corporation and its visionary founder shridhar vembu the mastermind behind this revolution is vembu who back in 2019 made the radical decision to leave silicon valley and move to a rural indian village called tenkasi building on zoho's first rural office established there in 2011 what is this unique approach it's zoho's work from village model a hub and spoke strategy that decentralizes global operations into smaller rural offices or spokes supported by larger urban hubs why this approach Vembu believes talent is ubiquitous and high quality software can be developed anywhere aiming to actively combat rural to urban migration and foster sustainable local economies here's a mind blowing fact zoho achieved over 1 billion dollars in annual revenue without any external venture capital funding proving its unconventional path works but how do these villages produce top tech talent Since 2004, Zoho schools of learning have been at the heart of this transformation. What are they? Innovative programs that train rural youth in cutting-edge software development and business skills, often without requiring traditional college degrees. Why this model? It addresses the skills gap, empowers underserved communities, and provides high-paying, world-class job opportunities directly in their hometowns. The impact is profound. Graduates now make up 15 to 20 percent of Zoho's global workforce, and in areas like Tenkasi, real incomes have surged by an incredible 50 to 60 percent over seven years. It's like planting digital seeds directly in the village soil and watching end. entire communities bloom into a vibrant economic garden and this isn't just about bringing jobs to villages it's about pioneering the future from them what is zoho doing now it's aggressively venturing into the scientific and technological frontiers developing its own large language models enhancing its ai assistant zia and exploring robotics even acquiring companies like esimo robotics in 2025 Why these deep tech investments to maintain a competitive edge ensure digital self-reliance by reducing dependence on third-party technologies and integrate advanced intelligence across its over 55 applications how are they achieving this by dedicating an astonishing 60% of their revenue to research and development which Sridhar Vembu himself now acting as chief scientist leading these current and ongoing innovations that are shaping Zoho's future right now in 2025 and beyond so what does this all mean zoho's work from village model isn't just a quirky experiment it's a powerful blueprint for sustainable inclusive global tech development proving that true innovation isn't location dependent why is this important it inspires us with a real life example of how business can drive profound social change and create world class opportunities in the most unexpected places how is it spreading this model is aggressively expanding to over 100 rural districts across india and even internationally to places like mexico the us and japan replicating its blend of local talent tech independence and community focus with india set to become its largest market within the next decade this incredible journey challenges our assumptions what if the next big tech breakthrough comes not from a city skyscraper but a quiet village like yours